Donald, where's your trousers? Hey y'all, one of you watching, it's me Jonas, and today I'm going to, frick, I'm going to talk about all my um, predictions and guesses of what's going to happen in Mom's Go Season 4. There's um, lots of stuff revealed for this season, not too much stuff, but, you know, I have lots of things to say of what I think is going on, going on and um, already I have some things that would change. So, um, let's get into it. Oh dear, that's been uh, revealed to come back. Now, um... When All Just Go Season 3 was just coming out, I was basically tired of All Just Go. I was truly fed up with it. But, um, I was thinking Duck wouldn't just, uh, I frick, I thought Duck would never appear again. Like, it seemed like they were implying in merchandise that Connor replaced Duck. Because it was like two time back to back in merchandise where in Duck's place, number eight was Connor. And I don't get why, but, um,. They could use any other character there in any time, but they used Khan, and it seemed like they were implying something. Luckily, though, Duck is coming back, and, um, I don't mind the yellow wheels. I know, I might be a bit bold, but, like, I don't mind them. Is, the, is it random? Yes, it is very random, and I don't understand why. I just don't get why they gave him yellow wheels. I'm like, they let James keep his black ones, and they did let Salty get his black ones again so like why not keep ducks black ones why keep saying black ones um i was surprised they kept the gwr i thought it'd be replaced with something so um ducks design is pretty decent honestly honestly i think he looks pretty faithful that we did look before um yeah i don't got too much to say until later but um one thing i want to say is is anyone, does anyone know the true context between, um, not between, um, on that on fake on go push on duck in the box leak? There's a leaked image of him on a store shelf that was weirdly mirrored, so I'll mirror that for you. I'll mirror it back. Does anyone know the context of that? Who made that? I don't know, but that's a pretty nice looking duck vector. I would like to use that, but I'm still going to stick with Aiden's, as I will show later. Um, yeah. Donald and Donald have been revealed. Yes, I do mean Donald and Donald. There is, for some reason, nothing of Douglas. So, Trackmaster Douglas, um, not Douglas, Trackmaster Donald was revealed from a front angle back in July uh, 4th this year. And, uh, yeah, he looks pretty alright. He looks pretty decent. And, um, now a Trackmaster image has been revealed, well, the full of it in image from the side view. And he actually has his nameplate, so yeah. Well, it was already shown on the side, but like, he actually has his name on it. I don't get why all just goes so inconsistent with their designs. Um, no, he looks decent, but, um, the problem is, the promo image. It's a bit disgusting. disgusting. What the frick happened? For some reason, that the stink nose design that Donald and Douglas had both had for the longest time, and even did out on the track mess mall, is not on the promo image. Those added handrails, also gone. Now, my theory is that this is an early design of Donald. It wouldn't be the first time we got an early design of a character. It happened with Salty, Thomas, um, yeah, 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 Pink Shima, Salty, James, and Emily, kind of. So, I think that might be the case here, why he looks so freaking weird. Um, and, I, and, like, his face is absurdly big. And it just, it just doesn't look right. So, um, so I went to MS, I mean, I, I went and added to the promo image. And here it is. Voila. Simple changes just to make it better, in my opinion. This makes a whole world of difference. I wonder what their episodes will be, assuming that Douglas is coming back as well, because it's called Common Sense. Um, all their episodes are pretty decent. I hope they treat them right. I hope they don't make them stupid children. So, um, yeah, they'll probably have their excellent. Now it's time to talk about the synopsis of On Go Season 4. Um, people already have their own guesses of what um, some of the stuff means. One thing says, um, the vehicles roll up, and the people are thinking that this will refer to the pack, because, you no, know, there is a construction, multi episode construction arc in this season, and people are thinking that the vehicles roll up is referring to the pack. I highly doubt that, because that's a lot of characters to bring back. And, like, I feel like we would have seen something from that by now. Like, who knows? 
I mean, like, I guess the reason... I mean, we didn't see Reginald or the Troublesome Tinkers beforehand. That's because they didn't make anything of them. They only, like, appeared in two episodes, and that's it. Um, I don't think the, this is referring to the pack. I'm going to sneeze. Yeah, never mind. I felt it. It went away. Um, I guess there's so many characters to bring back, and, like, I feel like we would have saw something like that from, from that by now. I highly doubt that. The other thing it says is no rail is too rocky. Now, this could be a typo. Maybe they mean rails. But, like, I like to think this would be some, like, episode plot where an engine is in, like, some high location. And it's a tightrope on one rail. I hope it's Toby. Because him and tightropes go better together than, um, than, than me and being gone. I don't know. Um, than Percy in the mail. Or Connor being an overrated character. Yeah, yeah, I'm up there, yeah, 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 I'm up there. Um, yeah. And, um, and one person's upload time on, no, it was all on the Go News thing. Um, that channel's been hacked by some Trump person. Um, they highlighted some text that, that said, you know, the steepest hills, and I think what that person's implying that this could be the return of Gordon's Hill. So now, um, Gordon's Hill is not in all just go, despite the fact, you know, for... Gordon Sill's not in on this go, despite what in the helicopter wants you to think. Um, so I guess could be the return of it, but I think it's referring to that one tall hill with the pink tree. So, um, yeah. What else? What else is in it? What else? This uh, says there's a few McCall mix-ups, which, great, that's freaking lovely. I'm yeah, freaking love ones. So, yeah. I want to talk about the merchandise now. <laughs> Now, some Trackmaster things have been revealed. I know it's not Trackmaster anymore, but hey, it's a better name than Motorized. So, um, it was a Trackmaster Carly and Thomas with Terrence. Um, the Terrence is reused from the CGI one. And, like, since it is, it doesn't really get the proportions of Owens Go Terrence, right? And also, it's under detail and looks horrible. Why not just make a new mold? It just doesn't look good. And just, I don't know. The CGI one actually looks good. That actually has some class. This just doesn't. Thomas has a mud scar. Yeah. So this will um, this will be some episode um, where Terrence uh, gets joined joins um, the construction arc. And um, I just hope they don't make him stupid like he wasn't travels to Terrence. I just wish they didn't make him a kid character, which I'll talk about in my own go review. I just felt like that was a dumb change. I just didn't feel right. I didn't feel right to... I don't want to talk about Terrence being kidding anymore. That's what I'm saying that from next week's review. Um, I just don't get it. Why does Terrence look so bad? Why does he look like that? But yeah, Thomas and Carly and Terrence and Diesel are getting repainted for the construction arc and most likely the rest of the main cast. Maybe Duck's wheels are painting yellow to go with the construction. No way he'd let his GWR get massacred like that, so it's probably... Yeah, that's, probably, that's a rough idea. More on Duck later. <clears throat> so, um... Yeah. Uh, I can't... I want to... This is basically going to be a marketing thing, and I wonder if it's going to be, like, obvious or something. Oh, well, yeah. I just wonder what are... Like, what are they constructing? I want to know, but Bruno's going to have a daring, dazzling delivery, and I'm not sure that is related to the construction. Maybe it's some... And that, like, that's powered, and maybe it's going to be, you know, that's probably going to be an episode, because it all has a D at the beginning. Daring, dazzling delivery. So, uh, probably going to be the episode title, Bruno's Daring, Dazzling Delivery, or just Daring, Dazzling Delivery, Daring, Dazzling Delivery. Actually, that's three, uh, ten times as fast. Daring, Dazzling Delivery, Daring, I'm not going to do it. I can't even do it. Um, yeah, I think that's all I'm going to talk about for that. Uh, next up. Now, I want to talk about my expectations and hopes for all this Go Season 4. Um, and what, what I'm expecting and what I think will happen and what I would change. Which, so far, I don't have too much to change. I think it's really not on Douglas. Um, duck. Dear. So, um, Aiden the Helicopter made an updated Duck Vector. Uh, which is actually modified from the Minch Genchi's updated Duck Vector. Not funny. Um... And he made an edit of it, which people thought was real, and I did for a split second, but then, yeah, I just found out I wasn't, you know, mildly ashamed, but we have more time to predict. Um, someone in the comments of his upload of it said, oh man, I really hope in all this go they continue to Thomas X, not Thomas X, Doc, frickin' X, that's frickin' gross! 
the Thomas versus Diesel, not Thomas versus Diesel, the Thomas versus Duck rivalry. I hope they keep Thomas and Duck's rivalry. What rivalry? I can't even say rivalry right now. I'm so freaking, this comment really bothers me, and I know it's nothing, but I, we all get bothered by small things in life, don't we? And this comment really bothers me, because there wasn't a Thomas and, there wasn't a Thomas versus Duck rivalry. They didn't have a rivalry. I can't even speak right. I'm guessing this person only said this because the Unlucky Tuck said it, and everyone daps on everything that the Unlucky Tuck says. Nothing against the Unlucky Tuck, of course. It's not his fault, but like, you know, it's just to be a scout fan of the biz. You know? And it just kind of bothered me. There wasn't rivalry. I hope they don't do that, because I'd be stupid. Why not bring back the actual rivalry, Duckhead? Which was a rivalry I accidentally mentioned when I said Thomas, instead of, you know, Duck. The Duck versus Diesel rivalry. Why not bring back that? I have a rough idea of what that could go. You could start off at Naffer Station with the uh, engines, you no, know, like engines picking up some deliveries. Doc's there and he has some, like, get, it's a tanker. No, I didn't make too many ads for this. Um, <clears throat> uh, drink, uh, punch yourself in the face every time I say um or uh or just oh, uh, um, um, and um. Not counting this. Um, yeah, here's another one. So Duck gets a tanker, that one old tanker. Don't know what episode that's from. And then maybe he has some kind of conflict with, well, not maybe. He has some kind of conflict with Diesel here. He has some kind of argument. You know, Diesel's grumpy. So Diesel just gets his rock delivery and Duck takes his tanker. You no, know, Duck, you no, know, Diesel's ahead of Duck. And then uh, Diesel gets distracted on the butterfly because we do that with him now. He's uh, softy a bit sometimes. And he ends up like, slowing down and ends up uh, dropping some rocks. Duck ends up seeing these rocks and, try, and tries to dodge it, but then when he makes it back, so he knew that now it's time to go. And when he, but then he kind of like leans back too soon, and the tanker's wheel gets hit, and it's all dented. And you know he needs help. He doesn't want to do it. You no, know, he just don't. He can't drive now because you know it wouldn't be great western or something. And then Thomas and Percy come along. And they they see what's happening. Ducks and they talks about what happened. It's Thomas that uh, goes to help Duck and like Percy. And maybe Duck said something about Diesel, like, Percy's like, uh, no, well, per well Diesel's actually not that truck, so he's not devious like that, and Duck's like, oh, well, you know, I only can't trust these Diesels. So, um, yeah, that's a rough idea of why that could happen. I have no nothing else, I just want to have for the episode, and I have nothing else for it. That could be a, that could be an interesting episode, and I wish they did that, but they can't really do it now. If they do do it, then that means, well, oh, they didn't strip it me off. Because they would already have the episode, they would already have the episodes like finalized, and they might not because um a higher quality image of ducks pushing on all got revealed, and he has cheekbones. It is like freaking enhanced by uh, AI, so it's probably not too official. But if this is going, if this is what we believe, if this is true, then I think I can say with full confidence, duck will be an adult character in all of I don't want him to be. I don't, because they won't be able to do the rivalry unless it's really awkward. Another thing, what's up with Connor and Duck similar? Do Diesel and Duck already have their similarities? Like, their weird names? You know? And being, like, one of a million bases? Yeah, I'm getting this from you. Out goes the Diesel! But now, for some reason, visually, there's some, like, notable things with Connor and Duck. They both have yellow eyes and yellow wheels. What else? 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 Who else do I think will return this season? No one. I think it's just Duck and Darwin Douglas. Do I think all go up a season five and six and beyond? Maybe. I mean, like I all go will end one day, of course. But like, that's not like SpongeBob. I think SpongeBob is going to go on forever and ever. But um, all go is going to end eventually. Um, probably around like next decade. Um. Now, do I think Edward and Henry will speak this season? No! I just don't think so. I don't think Mattel will be able to think of any... Well, I don't think anybody will have anything for Edward and Henry. I don't think they'll speak this season. Maybe I'm wrong, but I don't know. I highly doubt it. Um, I'm talking about All of Go Season 3 now. And its upcoming movie, The Christmas Letter Express, or whatever it's called. Oh, you know, it's... Uh, yeah, never mind. I'll talk about that after this. Um... Now, the plot seems a bit intriguing. Intriguing. Um, the thing is, though, will Santa Claus actually be real in all the go? I know the plot seems to imply that, but... So, um... I have to yell. So, will he exist in all the go canon? He doesn't the original canon. 
This would be a change I wouldn't mind if they did make Santa Claus non-real canole. Why is that? Um. Yeah. So I kind of wonder. I've been waiting for this movie for a bit. I thought it would release out late last year, but uh, I think it was announced last year, but it didn't uh, release that year. It's funny because now we, you can get that feel how long it takes to make something long ago because we're already in advance. Um, like in Bruno Shed, we knew about that last year and we didn't see it till this year, so, um, which it really looks like a stretch from season one, like someone pointed out. So, yeah. The Christmas letter. This is a Christmas letter express clip. I want to have a live reaction to it. Hi, Henry. Mm. That was all right. Okay, I bet. Cheer <laughs> Um, I don't think we're seeing the express coaches anymore. I don't think those are coming back. I know people want them back, but I don't think we are. And I don't want Rebecca back either. Um, I think that's it. Um, yeah, that's uh, that's it. That's all I have for on to go season uh, four. So, um, yeah. Bye, everyone.